Yeah, it was DNA for short. Uh, well, yeah, that's my rap name, but it's DNA. And this is about, this video is about the mind of a... What you need to do with your mind to be able to, because I don't know if I can say what I want to say. Because the last time they didn't let me monetize that video when I said what I wanted to say in the title. But um, as far as doing what you want to do, providing certain services and, uh, you know, running a business, whether it's illegal or legal, um, you have to have the mind for it. Your, your heart should be in it, but as far as your heart, that is really unimportant when it comes to business. And I was watching Dead Presidents and uh, the part where the dude who plays Pinky was about to kill Lorenz Tate. Well, he wasn't about to kill him, but he hit him with the, with the pistol in the face. He said he would only kill him over business. He wouldn't kill him over a, a bitch. So that's basically how you have to act. That's how you have to operate. You have to do things strictly off of the state of business in your mind i mean there's some times where you're gonna have to use your intuition and your emotions are gonna get involved you might get attached to a client something bad could happen whatever but as far as that what you want to do is let's say if you're a drug dealer you have to put in your mind only money in my last video that i just uploaded right now actually i said um Shit, I forgot what I was about to say. But you have to... Oh. Stu you have to study money. You have to program your mind. Your mind is... It's like a computer, but it's better. A computer can't learn. You can teach a computer, but it can't learn. You can put information into it, but it can't think, and it can't learn. It can only compute. But I don't think... It doesn't have thoughts. It only has information. It's not the same thing. Thoughts come from emotion. You and habits. You have to change your habits and your beliefs and your emotions. And by doing that, you have to program yourself. You have to take the initiative to feed your mind certain, certain programs, certain sounds, certain tastes. What does money taste like? What is money sound like what does money look like what does it smell like sometimes you have to just i'm not gonna lie sometimes you have to just meditate on the money sometimes you have to just tape the biggest bill that you have that you can keep from spending for about a week sometimes you have to just tape that shit to the wall at eye level and just stare at it sometimes you have to just keep it in your pocket and keep taking it out and looking at it sometimes you have to smell it Sometimes you have to just keep it in your hands and just do like this for 30 minutes. Just walk around like that. People are going to think that you're playing with your dick, but that's cool because they're not giving you money, so they don't matter. You have to just walk around. Keep it in your hands. Just feel it. Just put that. Put it in your mind. You have to learn about different industries, learn about different spiritual outlooks on money. What do Christians think about money? What do Hindus think about money? You have to learn about um, how to program your mind. And I am not a spiritual guru, but some of those things that I just taught you or scientists, they could work. They will, they, they will work and they have worked for me and for probably millions of other people, probably billions, since it's like 7 billion people on the planet right now. Probably billions of people, well, one at least, one billion but you have to do that. You have to put that. Wake up. Count your money. Wake up. Listen to Jeezy. Brush your teeth. Listen to Gucci. Eat breakfast. Listen to Juicy J. You have to listen to music with money in it all day. You have to watch music. You have to watch money TV all day. You have to watch Shark Tank, The Prophet, 
uh, greed, American scams, don't watch that because that might give you a negative outlook on money. That's another thing. You have to figure out how you feel about money. If you're real salty and you grew up poor and you're just angry at people who have money, that's really the worst way to get money or to look at money. I mean, yeah, it's, it's people that hate women that get hella bitches that would that just hate women to the core of them that just really and i know people like that that just every girlfriend they beat them up because they saw their mom get beat up and they hate women and if they do get married one day they're gonna end up killing their wives and they just hate women they think they're sluts and bitches but i don't want to go off subject money find out how to program your subconscious mind and that sounds like some scientist shit. But if you knew anything about your subconscious mind, then you would know. You have to apply money to all your senses. Even if it's... You have to smell money. Or what does something of quality smell like? What does Versace cologne smell like? I don't know how much Versace cologne is. What is Versace? What, uh, what does fucking brand new polo fresh out the whatever smell? Feel on your skin, fresh out the sweatshop. Feel on your skin. How does a, how does a brand new snapback, or fitted? How does that feel? How does that make you feel? How does what does quality food taste like? What does Ruth Chris and Chef, what is it? CF Changs, that ch Benny Hanna's. How does that taste? You know, how does Apply everything, all of those things to your senses. Hearing what is, what do Beats by Dre sound like? What are the best headphones that you can go and best buy and just the mo the thousand dollar headphones? What does that sound like? What does money sound like in that respect? What does it sound like when you crinkle it? Literal money and quality products and services. What does a hundred dollar an hour massage feel like? Shit like that. You have to use your mind. And when you get yourself there, you can put yourself in that state of mind anytime and program yourself, okay, this is the life I want to live or this is the amount of money I have to get. This costs this, so put yourself back in that state of mind and you will get that. That's one way of programming your subconscious mind and your senses as far as money, your money senses. You have to always be on it. You can't be lazy. You have to take action in a different way because what you're doing is not working. I'm not a millionaire and I'm not a fucking on my way to becoming a millionaire because I'm not in school right now. And that is the mode of transportation that I want to take to get to my millionairehood. But you have to start thinking differently, more philosophically, in my opinion, you know, because of course... There's something that you know that's not helping you. And there's something that you don't know that could be helping you that you're ignoring. If you don't have a if you have a girlfriend, you don't have money. If you don't have a bullshit ass girlfriend, like my girlfriend, I have to fucking pay to be my fucking girlfriend because she went through so much stuff with other guys and people used her. Whatever. I don't pay her to be my girlfriend. Not really. That's not what she thinks she's doing, but that's what she's doing. If you don't have people, make some friends. Anything happens to you, you need to be able to ask five people for $20. That was very random. I just I just threw that in there. But yeah, man. If you change how you think about money, what you think about money, and what money means to you feels like to you smells like to you tastes like to you whatever other senses i missed uh smell taste hearing hear smell here's like sounds like to you then you're doing something wrong i don't even know how i started that sentence but just change your perception on money and really get to know it money you don't want money you want what money can provide that's the whole point of these exercises. The money, the paper, means nothing. 
the gold means nothing. The outcome is everything. That's what you want. Change your perception on money and what you really want and program your mind to chase that. DNA, ooh, that was deep. I read too many books. Peace.